Hello friends, welcome to my channel. First of all, thank you all for visiting my channel and watching it. I have seen in comments that many, many people and many followers are saying that what's on, what is new in SAP solution my 7.2 SP15. So let's start with the session and I'll uh, update on that what is a new in SAP solution 7.2 SP15. Just give me a moment. Meanwhile, meanwhile, just one update that yes, this is my WhatsApp group. People who have joined, thank you for joining this WhatsApp group. I think people will know that what's the benefit of joining this group because the suggestions, answers and questions all are going well on this group. But yes, definitely we are going to increase the size in that. So please, I request you all to please uh, share this link as well as by scanning this group, you can join or share this link with your friends, colleagues, and also some people who you know, yeah. So going by uh, day by day, I would suggest, I would like to add new people in the group and they can get benefit of that. Yeah. So without having any doubt in this, let's start with in one uh, video in what's new series that is SP15. So let me start with the document. Thank you. So here's the document which SAP has released with what's new in SAP solution 7.2 SP15. Everyone knows that SAP uh, comes with new functionality, new added features, I think in every quarter once. So now they have released SP15 recently and there are some major topics for update here. Yeah? So let's see what is that. So what are, there are uh, new functions or you can say in terms of SAP always, SAP claims that these are innovations. So area of new functions where SAP has released, which is process management, test suite, change control management and business process operations. Because if you have seen a couple of <coughs> series or couple of uh, feature packs which SAP has released in SAP Solomon, they are doing innovations only majorly in process management, test suite, change control management, and business process operations, as these are the part of LM where it can compete with other uh, modules or other components or other products of SAP, yeah, like SAP Cloud LM and others. So they are trying to be competitive with the market along with its and their own product as well, yeah. So let's say what they have made changes major in process management. So agreed that process management is a not new thing in SAP Solomon 7.2. And after 7.2 SP, uh, 7.2 upgrade or migrations, the all things which are coming, those are Delta features only, yeah. So we all know that enhanced use to service, use to use list, layouts we use for business process analytics in user personalization. I think it was earlier for the public or private, but now they have added a, a bit more feature, generate documents of process diagrams, okay? Multi-selection of elements while documenting a process. Okay, they have given the mass operations here as well. Earlier, it was a part of focus build only. Uh, open executable in SAP GUI for HTML. Yeah, that is a, a totally a new feature. Further, more minus improvement, which are already a part of that, yeah. So now you can see in this uh, diagram, if I would like to enhance of 100%, or not 100 then at least for, uh, yep, I think that is fine. Let's see, which shall fit in one group, yeah. So now you can see if uh, this is where to you list, where it is showing, agreed, because SAP comes with new features, but there are some uh, notes as well, a request which you have to follow to get benefit of the, the features, yeah. So element search was earlier. Now you can see 
flag direct usage a way to use list example you can say let's see where it is showing now just they have okay default path object logical component this is okay so you can see up there this is where to branch all information is coming here like in where to use list now you can see here where to use list is coming here all the things are coming so if i talk let me annotate here anno annotate what is annotate yeah sorry let's annotate here now you can see here this is where to use list which is a new parts which sap has save given here and where we have we are getting the our executables and it also based on diagrams and other parts so here you can see the types of the uh, uh libraries yeah now you can see these more default functions or you can say these options which are process layouts were earlier like this one only but yes now they have a bit they have increased in that number of parts in that where you can it you can save it via in your layout means by default whenever you log in it will be open your view yeah and that is only for layouts based on work area business process i think that was earlier as well but now they have given some more options yeah thank you in process management diagrams you can say you can create document from here yeah after going that you can just save as you can see here and after saving as you can save as document yeah so export fit to space edit save as and after that you can make it i think these options was already you while exporting or while saving at it was coming earlier as well but sap has written it once again in the for, from previous one now multi selection here you can say that it is a mass maintenance of the objects which sap has given or oh, that is uh, i think nothing new but yes some improvement are here in this you can see you can just of supported elements or documents test documents executables process steps interfaces configurations process links and the um, development objects yeah there are some minor improvement as well you can see there are some process management business process monitoring they are just giving a small features here let's say what is a new in test suite if you are fond of solution manager test suite then i think this would uh, definitely help you to understand the new features however you cannot see a uh, straight way but yes some of the parts you can see via this document by seeing this document and go, going these videos and checking in your system you will find some new things here but yes first of all you have to have sp15 installed or updated with newer version thank you so what i said uh, you can say these are the key points test package maintenance show your team members earlier we were showing the uh, not showing but now you can say test a work list edit quick edit manual test execution test case description mass copy add missing test cases test plan management test sequence and analytics yeah so now earlier if you uh, what you can see you can see the test that which team is from but yes definitely you have to maintain somewhere uh, the details yeah in sap team which all members are in the sap team so first of all you have to maintain the team and then you will be able to see that now the test of work list here again while clicking on this you will get a quick edit option earlier this was not available but now you can see here here you can say a test description we can maintain earlier it was a part of test plan management only but now it can be done in test execution also 
space suite innovations what add so this tick they have given that add missing test cases if it is already planned so after that you will be able to see the test packages as well this plan management assigned to new test packages here Definitely these options, which will you give, you, you can you know, do it a fingertips and I think it will increase the productivity as also the user experience. You can say it is a UI5, but definitely if you want to take benefit of UI5, you have to use uh, any of UI5 app, uh, browser like Chrome or uh, Microsoft Edge, Mozilla Firefox and others. Yeah. These are the something which SAP say that this is related to the analytics part. Now come to change control management. <clears throat> I think I cannot see many of the changes here, but yes, some of the parts which SAP has already written here, logging to CTS status switch changes, consistent cleanup of importer transports, streamers import queue. Okay, this is a really good thing which SAP says if it is done in SP15 because if you run a job we are uh, to uh, import the transports and if history of the imported transports are not cleaned up then it will try to import again yeah as a general until you go with customized options housekeeping that is also good enable the multiple transport request selection declare okay that is also good Flexibility to check the correlation between the partner function PFC0. Okay. They create transport of copies only few subtasks. Okay. Only for new subtask. Fine. By using this bodies and other retrofit. Since change control management, you can see that what is a, a new things they have just retrofit with change control. These are the options given along with these overview options from me you can see that change con consistent cleaned up it is here in actual if you work on the sv15 then you will be able to see the what are the changes that there would be some <coughs> sorry bugs as well but yes going forward you will get some new information new notes as well for uh, improvement as well as uh, corrections what sap says because there are some it, it basic things which we do in charm and yeah definitely this is some of our object list which is coming here change control management innovations this is a body of only for development system, I can say, because it is for innovations. Release planning display on open cycles. Okay, that, that is a really good thing if you are use, going to use the release cycles of solution manager. Optimize search with scheduled import. Uh, means this is only for search. They have tried to give the better search criterias to make a quick result as well as refinement. They are going with some refinement as well. Okay, direct import of transport of copies. As for process operations, business process operations. So external schedule of further for the job definition attribute for display your job chain documentation and external scheduling of job chain via BP or Redwood. Hand over, hand over to precaution, uh, precondition information. I think this is related to JSM job scheduling management, where it comes as a part of business process operations. And here they have added some more attributes for users who can just only for display users. Yeah. So I think if you are using this one, you can take benefit of this one. Okay. Now your job chain management documentation as well. They have given some options. So I think that is a good part to have this in place. And along with that, 
these are the parts and along with that sap doesn't fail to recommend or uh, what i can say that is promote our media center internet demo system private cloud system which is sap cloud uh, which is you can say uh, cloud appliance library sap cal this is everyone is aware and this is what we have seen here yeah that is end of this document along with this i would also like to uh, give some information related to our channel and the options and even the videos which i am creating please guys please watch the video till end because at the end you will get you, 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 you some of you have some questions please ask questions in the my group means whatsapp group as well as into comment as well and i have i'm trying to answer all of the questions as soon as possible and also please my watch my basic videos which i have already created in past and if you have not subscribed my channel please subscribe it please share this videos and my channel link with your friends family as well as your colleagues who wanted one who wants to have information about solomon cloud lm and focus run i'm going to create a next video on sap cloud lm so please suggest which topic you want to start first and then and from today onwards i have uh, given a new options that in a week i'll be creating three videos one on solution manager one is sap cloud lm and third is on sap focus run so in one week you will get three videos whatever you like focus run or sap cloud lm or solution manager please come with me and please add your views and please share your feedback on my youtube channel thank you so much for watching my videos have a nice day ahead guys